All right, boys. They thought they could drive. Yes, sir. Welcome back to another video. Here today, we're breaking down the 7.6 update preview and maintenance notice. We're going to be going through the events that we have added. And is this the first time they've added a Roxy or like an animated type of emoji over here? I've never seen that before, but it actually looks pretty cool. So, yeah. If you haven't already subscribed or left a like, you consider doing so. It really does help out a ton. Let's go for a solid 500 likes on this video if you guys are hyped about all these events. With no further delay, let's jump straight into it. New heroes, we have the special Oslo and Hawk officially added to the game. Reach 600 loyalty points and on the banner is in fact the two people that people wanted to go and summon for, which is in fact, you know, Ex Executioner Soldiers and Assault Melee. Is this the banner to go and summon for? Not really. I already know people are going to get trigger happy just because these two are on there. Up to you what you want to do about it, but yeah. They also added the greatest costumes of the game that everyone has been waiting for. Valenti, Easton, and Awaken Lilia. They are now here. You guys can go and get them in the game. Uh, for this one, you have to craft gifts at the gift workshop and give uh, them to the 7 Catastrophe Heroes to get fan art costumes. With this one, you had to do that little like Hawk and Oslo event. Uh, I think it's like the, it looks like Pokemon or something like that. That's the event that you guys can go and take part in. Grand Cross Second Anniversary Festival Events Part 2. We have Special Missions Part 2. We have Gift Party and Gift Workshop. Hawk's Dreamland Adventure. This is the one that I'm talking about over here. We have the Fight Festival Victory Event. Fort Solgris. Yeah, this this is what we're looking at. This is the, uh, I think they also give gems by this one. I could be wrong, but I think, yeah. Boosting Events. Brawl Rewards Upgraded, which is, again, not bad, but... You guys can look down the list. You also see what I'm what I'm kind of been hyping up for days now. And yes, it is now official confirmation that uh Yeah, it's here, boys. It's here. That's all I gotta say. And yeah, the equipment salvage, but this, this is what we're looking for. SSR equipment draw rate right up. This is the gear gotcha that I've been mentioning so many times in my videos. Please go take advantage of this. If all that gold you've been grinding, everything you've been taking care of. That is where you're going to be spending it, and you're going to be walking away with so many materials. It's like it's literally a free-to-play dream. That is what that event is. Greatest event ever. I can't wait for it. We have the uh, the battle event here, which you guys can now go take part in. And yes, SSR pendants, please. I need them. Thank God they're actually in this. We also have popular uh, hero costumes returning, which are these two sets. I don't know if this is for gems. If it is, I highly recommend you guys go buy this one. And if you have LV, go buy that one. Very good uh, purchase just for festival costumes. And again, I don't know if they're going to be for gems. We will have to see how it does go. If anybody played the JP version and it, you know, when it returned over there, do you know if it returned for gems? I have no idea. So, yeah, we're going to go into that like that. We have Night, uh, Nighthood Boss Calic also being added back. We have all these bundles over here. Highly recommend. I think this was the one that was like nicely priced. Again, I don't remember how it went on JP, so we will have to find out tomorrow. This could change where it's like a garbage price. So, yeah. I will find out then and let you guys know, update you on all of that. This is the Knighthood competition schedule, and we have a system change regarding the Christmas Elaine. She actually, I think, caught a buff, which is not that bad. Anybody that uh, got this during the uh, event, you know, the special draw, you now have a buffed Elaine, which is, hey, I'll take it, I'll take it. And they're also going to be ending the Excalibur Arthur step-up draw, so if you want to go and complete that, you are, you know, you can go do that. Last but not least, we have all of the ending events for you guys to go and finish up. Make sure you take part of all of this, you know, just uh, break it down, finish it, get it out of the way. The only ones that are, I think, really, you can do last day, uh, I guess, just do everything, right? There's not much you can just finish up uh, if you haven't started day one. But yeah, that's really it. Not bad at all. This is the update. Best of luck with everyone. The greatest event is here. The greatest costumes are here. So many things in this one update. Given it's like, you know, a regular, just, I guess, part two to a festival, they did very well with it. It's literally the fan art costumes. It's, you know, this thing, which is going to take most of my time just burning all of my gold and all that I got. That's been it for me. Thank you again for watching. Peace out, everyone. Enjoy the rest of your day. Have fun with the 7-6 update, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Later!